video I'm planning on making a warehouse and this is probably going to be the base here but I might make it a bit longer somehow so yeah we'll see where this one goes and I hope you enjoy watching. So here's like the blueprints for the warehouse and it's not too exciting but I don't really want a lot going on for this one. I just kind of wanted it like some regular warehouse that like, I don't know, Punisher might end up in or something like that. The turtles might end up in here. Just having sets so like if I want to use a certain, like do a certain scene in a stop motion video, I can have like a warehouse ready or like whatever building or whatever. So. Just got like, I'm gonna make like a crate here and then like have like green tinted windows or something or might just make windows. And then I'm gonna try and make like a garage door. Probably just gonna like cut out like here, except leave that part so like it can swing open. Uh, yeah, just pretty much spray painted all silver. And then add a lot of like black and dry brush so it looks kind of grimy and stuff. Yeah, so that's that one. So I hope you enjoy watching. So everything is pretty much done here. All I need to do is just paint it. And then once I'm done painting, I'm going to add uh, Marvel Legends, like the clear piece out of the box for the window in the back. And it should be done. I think I'm gonna add some like boxes and stuff and like little crates in the corner, but besides that, everything should be done. All right, so here's where the warehouse is at. I painted the main base of it gray and I added some black as well. And over here for the garage door, I made it silver. able to open up so now I'm just gonna add some details with like Sharpie like add the lines on the garage door and like add cracks and stuff uh, draw like little rocks and whatever and yeah just try and make it look a bit more grimy or dirty and I'm probably still gonna add uh, little like crates and boxes in the corner and then I still need to add the clear piece for the window, but here's the main base of it so far. So here's how the warehouse is looking so far. I added these here and they're what I was trying to go for is like the warehouse has been kind of abandoned and like run down. So there's like a ton of just vines and moss and stuff growing from some of the cement cracks the back here I still need to add the plastic Marvel Legends box I'm gonna glue it behind so it looks like the window and to fill up this space here I made um, these like little boxes these bad boys I made three of these and I'm gonna paint them all black and with, um, I'm forgetting the name of these, but these things, <coughs> Popsicle 6, instantly remember his name. I cut them to the length and I'm gonna glue them afterwards. And there's three of them that's gonna be piled up there. To, so I think that's gonna look cool when it's all put together. So this is how the first box looks. I'm still probably gonna dry brush a bunch of brown on it, but that's the main base of it. Oh, there's so, so much of these though. Oh, I finished up all the crates. I dry brushed some brown and black all over them all. And uh, yeah, let's throw them in the warehouse and see how it looks. And this is how it looks fully done. I got the crates in the back there. 
I got some moss and like just debris and stuff in the warehouse and the roof somewhere yeah here and there's just like a little chain dangling from I don't know whatever something yeah the garage door can open so if I want a scene of uh, someone entering the warehouse and I don't know doing like a deal or something Batman Punisher whoever it may be can show up oh, but yeah it's done it's uh, magnetized like the other ones as well and yeah I hope you enjoyed watching. Because <laughs> we done. <laughs>